Okay, it's fine. So, <clears throat> this is how far we are. I got the blacked out lights. Right now I'm doing the oil change. I'm going to that right now. Let's check on the back lights. So they look pretty cool. I also changed the frame of the whatever. And I took off the crack in the back. There was some kind of crack right here. Oh, no, it was on the other side. So this side, I just put this little design on it. And then I copied it on this side. It's really hot out here, so there's a lot of water balls around here. And, uh, yeah, it looks like that. And... There's one bolt missing right here, and there's one bolt missing on the other side also as well. So I gotta replace that, and I finally got this loose, like I showed you on the other video, with that one wrench, with the adjustable wrench. And right now I'm doing the oil change, but I also cut the fender in the front because it had like a crack or some kind of scratch on it and I just cut it they don't want to mess with it it looks pretty good hey get over there go go there go go hey <laughs> okay so, I'm going to show you guys what I did for the oil. This is how I have my pan here. Because there's a crack on this side. So, I don't want it leaking. Okay. I'm going to show you what I did. I saw this in a video. So, you lift... So you have your bike on the stand, right? You have it on the stand. And then you just lift it on this one corner. On the really solid corner. And um, the bike should just stay up and... I'm not liking that. And um, just, you know, be good for whatever you want to do to it so it was good for me to just get under in and do the oil change so I'm about to do that and because I'm thinking it's gonna be hard to get to the oil can or the oil filter or whatever so what I'm gonna do is um, drill a hole through it and then just twist it off and then the new one I'm just hand tighten it because that's how it should be that's how I do my cars. And I've never had it. So, yeah. And I put these handlebars on it. Some big old... I want to call them big horn handlebars. Make some, some wide ones. I got... So I got the grips on it that I went to purchase from my local bike shop. And here's the, the mirror, nice and big, so I can see, I only have one, so I might as well just make it a nice one, it doesn't look that bad. Let's, let's check it out. Yeah, it looks decent. I want to change this right here, because this is kind of corny. It's alright, it looks good. But I want just something different. It looks too black, out, too much black. So, I might even switch to some LEDs, I don't know. I 
I'm gonna switch out the, the fork, the tree. Check it out, this big old crack right here. I just found. So, I'm gonna change that one out. I don't want no wiggle and it just wobble, death wobble and just, you know, this is not hardly. So, I don't know, it looks, it's been good. Take care of it. I like change the color I don't know later on when it gets all messed up in the sun or use for use go to work with it all right guys I don't want to take too much of the time it looks pretty good let me see if they did any mods to the exhaust Nah, it looks all stuck. Goes pretty far back, huh? I might drill a hole right through those things. I don't know. Anyways. <laughs> don't give me any ideas. Alright, guys. I'll see you guys later. Stay safe out there. Be healthy.